Hello! It's me. I'm here to play some Endzone. Now, as I've said before, Endzone is not an American football game. It's a city builder. It's an apocalyptic city builder. I've been playing it quite a bit, you know, over the last couple weeks. Um, I love city builders anyway. You know, Banished and Surviving the Aftermath and stuff like that. Surviving Mars. Those are really, really, really great games. Um, this is, I think, comparable. Oh, post, what was that one called? Post Apo Builder, something like that. I played a demo of it a couple weeks ago. Um, yeah. I mean, that was a, a demo, so it was very s short and sweet, but it had some great little mechanics to it. One of them being the strip club. If you want to make a great game, no, I'm not, I'm not even going to say it. Okay, so... <laughs> Let's continue our little world we have going on here. Um, there is still so much to do in this game. We didn't even get to electricity yet. We did get to explorers last time, which is fun. I have to try to remember what's going on. Oh, I have lots of people with no tools and no protective clothing. Okay, well that seems to be my number one priority right now. Open missions on the bulletin board. Um... Let's see what this one is. One of our hunters tells us that the local wildlife population is on the rise. We ought to take advantage of this opportunity to get some more protein on our tables. Radioactive protein, right? All right, let's do it. So I just made that one of my missions. Oh, I have a lot of missions, actually. Let's see. Um, oh, I need to make some more radi radiation suits. So we have them. They're making radiation suits. They are making radiation suits. Who else is making radiation suits? I think it's just those two. Yeah, I just have two tailors. Um, and I have four. They're full. Four out of four tailors are uh, making radiation suits. <coughs> but it's not enough, you know. I think I'm going to make another... Let's make another um, tailor shop. Maybe that'll help. Let's zoom in a little bit here. Uh, I can't fit one right there. I thought I could. Well, let's go right here. Alright, so... Then that way I can assign... More. We're doing pretty, pretty well, though. You know, we have 110 settlers. Adults. And 33 kids. Um, if you tuned in last week... I think it was Tuesday last week. I was all th the settlement was almost done. Everyone was dying. People were not reproducing. There was people dying of old age. It was getting pretty ugly. Um, so I'm kind of reminding myself where I'm at right now. These people are very happy. Cool. But like I said, we we're not even to electricity yet. You know, we still have quite a bit to go before that happens um do I have any explorers out oh they're making rations they're almost ready they just need tools I desperately need tools there's my oh why are they making scrap tools people <laughs> scrap tools are a waste where's my other workshop it's right here yeah metal tools Metal tools. Cool. Let's see. What are those people called? Um, the workshop people. It should have the little... Icon, or technician. I knew it was something... Because technicians work at workshops and ammunition factory. Which I do not have yet. So that'll be fun. You know. Once we are making ammo. Alright, let's check out these. So, I have to make radiation suits. That's one of my tasks. And that I have to do in four and a half seasons. Uh, my reward will be 15 settlers. That'd be cool. Uh, tools. I only need a couple more. And they'll, I'll get 27 metal tools if I can just make a couple more. 
And then hunting season is the one I just got. We have to, oh, lots of venison, lots of wild boar, hare meat. Wow, where are we going to get all this? Buffalo meat. I just saw buffalo meat and chicken meat together, and I thought of buffalo chicken, and I was like, uh, <laughs> buffalo chicken. Ah, <laughs> oh, man. It's a good thing I just ate, huh? Um, so, yeah, those are my three tasks right now. And if you saw what I did, I basically, you click on the forum and you can take any of these uh, quests. What does this one do? Um, oh, I have, to, I have to complete some before I can get more. But it's a good way to earn, you know, some extra settlers and some extra tools and all that good stuff. How's everything else going? Let's see, my research... I'm, I'm researching defense strategies right now, which is cool. Uh, looks like it's going to take a little while. So I'm going to speed it up. Speed things up. I wonder what the... Oh, there we go. Our engineers made an extra effort to immediately do something against the shortage of tools. That will surely help us quite a bit. Thanks, Chief. Rewards 27 metal tools. I like how you have to make a certain amount of metal tools in order to get a bunch more. So that's cool. That gave me a bunch of tools. But I'm still... Oh, I have a homeless, homeless settler? Ooh, time to make some more houses. Research is done. All right, let's make one. Let's continue our little street right here. And we'll just make one right here. Okay, tailor shop is done. That's awesome. I'm going to make some more radiation suits. Um throw another tailor. So we have six people working specifically on radiation suits right now. And I'm not really sure what the... Oh, cloth. Cloth is the hold up. Let's see. So, my recycling places metal, cloth. I have one doing cloth. Electronics and plastic. Maybe that's not enough. Maybe I need to Let's change this plastic one into cloth. Yeah. So we'll try to get more cloth so we can make more radiation suits, you know. Yada yada. I have a lot of plastic, so I think I'm good on that. Alright, what else? Oh yeah. Hunting. I don't know how we're going to do that. Where's my hunter? Right here. I think an alternative to that would be to make, let's see, I can change, oh, I can make rabbits there now. Um, huh, what is the advantage of rabbits? So I can, I can have five deer which gives me, it's 30 demand on water, reproduction 1.1, 240 food. Of course they reproduce like rabbits, so they reproduce a lot more quickly and 100 food. Oh, let's do that. Five animals are still located in this pasture. Do you want to slaughter all the animals for 1,200 food? Let's slaughter them because I need that for the quest. I'm not going to zoom in on that. We'll, we'll, we'll get away from that as they take care of business. Um, Everything else is looking good. My water, my water is actually, it looks low, but it's actually my, my wa water storage is so big that it's not bad. Oh, I have too many kids <laughs> and in the game. Am I right? Um, so I can't, they can't all go to school with that many kids because I only have two schools. Should I make another school? Not sure. S 
still gathering scrap over there. Let's move that to here. Oh. Yeah, right here so we can clear this out. I want to start building over here. Why is this... Oh, a scrapyard. I have to do it with the scrapyard. Okay. Well, let's do that then. Let's move this over here so we can clear that out. Um, since we're already there, I'm going to move this back. Our hunters found some interesting plant remains in the animals' stomachs while they were gutting them. One of our experts thought we might be able to grow the plants on our field if we could find an undigested specimen. Is that how that works? I think you just need the seeds. I don't think you need an eye. Okay. Why don't we comb the forest and search for that plant? Oh, okay. So we're looking at the plant in the stomach and we're saying, let's compare. Ooh, man. Oh, okay. Still need a couple more suits. I should be finishing that one soon. Um, herbs. Lots of herbs I need. Let's see. Where are my gather plants? They're all right there. Let's move that. Let's move it right there. Oh yeah, I have my trading post too. I forgot about that. Time remaining until the next trader arrives. Okay, so I don't have a trader yet. What's this? That's the herbal hut. They're doing a good job. Good job. Good job. Should I build another school? I feel like I should. Just because there's so many kids. Um. <clears throat> so I have one right over here. Where's it at? Right there. But this is also the community area. So. Let's go ahead and do one right here. I don't know why. It just looked like uh, looked like a good idea, you know, a good place to put a school. City I grew up in had five high schools. It's a pretty big city, and uh, some of them were pretty close to each other. So that's my rationale. Um, what is that? So my plan, if I haven't explained it already, industrial is pretty much going to go this way. Residential is going to go this way. Kind of fill out down here. And then farmland, stuff like that is going to go up here. Boy, I am still having problems housing my people. All right, let's make some roads. I'll just continue this out here. This one. That way I can make some some new roads um, and houses. I'll just make a whole block of houses right here. Uh, oh. There we go. Hopefully that helps. Amazing chief, we've managed to meet all their demands and they're on their way to our settlement. Every helping hand makes us stronger. We should prepare a warm welcome for them. Uh oh. I just got a bunch more settlers. Um, need to make more houses. We ought to make some space available to the Outlanders to help them forget their long and exhausting journey. As a quick workaround, a shelter would probably be the best solution. I have two shelters. We could provide them with a campfire too. 
All right, well, I have two shelters. Um, where's my campfire? Ooh, I can almost upgrade. What do I need? More wood. I can't forget to do that. My wood is really low. What's going on there? I need to hire more uh, foresters. Where are they at? Forester, right there. Oh, oh yeah, I can hire a lot more. Oh yeah, look at that. Oh yeah, look at that. Um, still low on. You know what I should do? I should make another scrap collecting thingy. Scrapyard. That's what they call it. Make another scrapyard, but I don't want to make it up here. Yeah, I'll just make it up there. Auto saving game. That means I have to wait a second. I don't have to. All right, we have a lot of people. We still have one person who needs tools. Lots of them need protective clothing. And 18 of them don't have houses? Wow, okay. Let's, uh... Let's go down the line here. Build some new ones. I'm just making such a like a cookie cutter thing here, but that should be good. Now, I probably won't be able to build all this because I don't have enough wood. Um, what's the deal with these guys anyway? Don't know. Oh yeah. Research. I forgot about research. Um I don't have any points though. So Okay. Almost done making a point. So my big problem now is cloth. I need cloth and I need wood. Cloth and wood. Getting I got a f little bit more cloth than I had before. Maybe once they make this other scrap yard I can use it to uh you know, extract more scrap. Man, these people are slow. Oh, they need more activated carbon masks. Uh, I don't want to stop production on the radiation suits to make those things. Oh well, they're going to have to wait. So I still have 20 settlers to be housed. Oh, and I have to make hard liquor, too, in the pub. All right, well, that's going. Cool. All right, I am in season 60. I can't believe that. I think la well, I think I just started, was it two weeks ago? Well, I played the demo for a while. That took a while. A demo... This game's demo is pretty in-depth, which, you know, you have to appreciate. Is this person making roads? Yeah. 
Who is that? Let's see who that is. Oh. I need him to get out of the cabin there. Oh, Amelia. She's an old adult. Her profession is builder. She enjoys long walks down a stone path. She has, let's see, builder badge and water carrier badge. Good job, Amelia. I just saw those rabbits. It reminded me of my pasture. Cool. Where'd that food one go? Huh. Didn't I have another? I had the one where I had to gather all the food. Oh, well. It's fine. Wow, I have 21 extra settlers who aren't really doing anything. Do another pub keeper. Oh, I built another school, didn't I? Oh yeah, cool, okay. More teachers. What else? Medic? Uh, uh oh, what was that? A traitor has arrived. Why do you just let me know in such in a nicer way than just blur? <laughs> you know what I mean? That was like a like a danger noise. That was like a your your chief just died noise or something. What else? Farmers, gatherers, herders, water carriers. I think we're good on all that. All right, so trader, let's see what the trader has. Hi there. I'm Susan Melfi, meteorologist and flying saleswoman for a versatile number of uh, versatilities. I have a whole range of things your settlement can definitely make good use of. Maybe we could do some business, huh? Well, Susan Melfi, I need... I do need radiation suits, and I do need rubber bullets. Um, I don't need that stuff. Okay, so I'm going to get a couple radiation suits. And... Mm, Iodine. Do I want to give her iodine? No, I don't. I, I don't want to give her iodine. Metal bullets. What? Sulfur. I guess I'll give her a little bit of iodine. Oh, what's that say? This resource is not available in a sufficient quantity at the settlement and must be produced first. Oh. Okay. Um, I don't really have a lot of stuff I could trade. Hmm. Well, sorry, Susan Melfi. I'm going to say never mind. Yeah. I just want to watch the balloon float. Oh, that's cool. Look at. Oh, oh. It's like a house attached to a balloon. That's pretty cool. Trying to, trying to zoom in. There we go. That is cool. All right. I was hoping I could trade for these um, activated carbon masks so I could send these people out. But no such luck. All right, well, we're going to try. I'm just going to try to make some. 
because we really need to send them out. Man, when I am down on wood, it is not not a good situation. Oh yeah, I have one over here too. Is this another one? Oh yeah, that one's not even done yet. Right? Huh. I forgot I made that one. Alright, so. Where are we at? We need... We just need wood. That's kind of our big thing right now. I'm going to speed things up. Sometimes I like to speed things up to watch my resources and kind of see how they're going. Like my food is going down. Oh, it's going up and down. Oh, well. So I might need to do something about that. Soon. Oh, drought is coming. I still have 16 homeless settlers. But I can't do anything till we can get these houses built. And I need to get ready for that drought. See, it's funny how everything works together. You know, you have the coal place can't make coal because they need wood. Um, can't make charcoal, activated charcoal masks because I don't have coal, which needs wood. So it's like wood is such a big thing, you know. Might help if I build some roads out here too. Let's see. Um, I'm going to build this one. Uh, I can't really. There's a big thing right in the way. Are they done? No, they still have a lot to get. Everybody's so busy and nothing's getting done. <laughs> it's kind of weird. 140 people though, that's really cool. And these kids, man. I guess I guess I need to increase my food production here a little bit too. Get another water carrier, another gatherer, another hunter. Yeah, I was pretty low on those. There's a lot of people living in these shelters. Oh, cool, they finished those houses. Well, that means I need to build more. I kind of didn't want to go too nuts with the houses because I know I'm going to get an upgrade. And I don't want to have to, you know, tear down houses to build upgraded ones, but it's kind of getting to that point. Or I might just have to do it anyway. Oh, cool. This is finished. 
Let's uh, let's make this one go back over here. What right? Th Ooh, that's a good spot. I didn't even know they finished this one. That's cool. I think you should start. Oh. <laughs> that wood is killing me. Alright, I have a knowledge point now. Let's see if I can spend it on something good. Um, I can make a hemp weaving mill. Improve radio. Oh, yeah, warehouse. That's something I really wanted. Wind turbine. Advanced school. What does the advanced school do? Oh, it, it fully educates children in all subjects. Educational training also occurs distinctly faster than a normal school. That might be a good one. Let's see, which one leads to better houses? The, of course, this one. Sturdy house. That would be after loitering ban. Prohibit settlers from boosting their confidence by visiting their homes or other buildings and, as a result, distracting them from their work. See, that one seems mean, but I think it's, I think it's necessary because I do want to get some upgraded houses. So, yeah, let's do this one. Still the same problems. Oh, we're getting some wood though. Need one more mask. Need coal. Food is going down. That's weird. Um, uh, let's see. Let's do another gatherer, another fisher, another farmer. I should probably make another pasture too. Um, I should make more farmland actually. Let's do that. Let's make... Let's make that farm. Many of our sellers are forced to move across this wasteland unprotected. We should boost our production of protective clothing. I agree. Let's see. Now that's a quest, so... Now they want me to make activated carbon masks. All right. So, maybe what I should do is uh, make another tailor shop. Because obviously the ones I have are not working to their full potential.
All right, I just made this farmland out here. Still having a problem getting cloth. What's that? Trader? Another trader. Let's see what this trader has. Oh, ah, the old bones, hey? Hey, don't stare like that. Or do you like what you see? <laughs> but old Chief Barry even got much better things in store. I know how to make customers happy. Take your time, look around. I'm sure we'll do business with each other. <laughs> All right. So there's a joint. Apparently, you can make marijuana cigarettes in this game. Neck scarf, cloth, herbs, water. Um. Well, I do need cloth. Let's see if I can just get a ton of cloth. This guy, I'm sure, wants some mushrooms. A hearty meal. Oh, I don't have any hearty meals. Um, beer. I don't think I have any beer. Radiation suit. No. Let's give him a couple of those. He thinks that's fair. And a couple mushrooms. Get going. So, he, he wants all this. Uh, okay, let's just slide that. Oh. I don't have enough to do that. Okay. So, let's see if I can get one more cloth out of him. Oh. Oh. Okay. 27 cloths for a bunch of shrooms and some decontamination kit. Let's see if he does it. Ah, that sounds fair. A nice, agreeable deal. And with such a good-looking gym to boot. <laughs> Great. But hurry up. Even though I'd love to stick around to show you the added advantages of making a deal with old T. Barra, nonetheless, <laughs> duty calls. <laughs> that is a character right there. Okay. Sweet. So we have some cloth now, right? Are we... Oh. My people have to bring this stuff up to him. Oh, he has a nice little balloon there. Look at that. <laughs> That's cool. Like, the detail in this game is amazing. I love that. That's really cool. Okay, where were we? What were we doing? Oh, yeah, drought's coming. We, uh, let's see. Have enough water carriers. I have 146 people. Wow. I still need to build so many houses. Let's just, um, let's just go for it here. There, there, there. Okay, these people have some, like, Nice little lake backyard, right? All right, my research is done. There's no more no more loitering. That's pretty cool. Um, where am I at? Right there. Cool. I could make more research centers. But 
my priority here is tools, protective clothing, and ho housing these settlers. Also, I think, let's see, I want to look at this tree here. Somewhere around here, it'll make your people faster. Pay, oh, let's see, paved road will, motivation, that's what it is. Yeah, 25, that's what I need. I really need faster workers, right? Um, paved road will help with that too. Yeah. And then warehouse, all that kind of stuff. That'd be cool. Wind turbine. I'm excited about that and getting into solar and batteries and all that. That's fun. Um, I already have a pipe system. Yeah, there's a lot of good stuff to research. I always wonder if they're tearing down trees to make room for an air for a new build. We I mean, I imagine we saved that wood, right? I guess that would make sense. Look at all these workers. There's a lot of people. I have a bustling little city here. Or town, I guess. All right, what's the problem here? Need cloth and coal. Need cloth. Need cloth. Yeah, cloth is a big one. So, I'll probably build another recycler. Let's fit that right there. So we'll do another recycler. Get more stuff from the scrap. Because we have, you know, a fair amount of scrap. All right, let's speed it up. My food is still going down. Oh, I haven't chosen a seed yet. So, beets or beans? Let's do beets on this one. That should give us some more food. We also have, let's see. Yeah, I can hire a couple more farmers. I still have nine people to house. Wow. Oh, let's see. One, two, three, four, five. I think the way this does housing, it's not like a lot of games where it'll just put random people together in houses. This one, like, you know, it'll put like a person in a house and then I guess they marry and then they, you know, there's just not other random adults moving into houses at the same time, which, you know, makes sense, I guess.
That's a, that's a lot of houses. I better be good enough for you people. <laughs> Ooh, I'm getting close to the herb one. Hmm. Activated charcoal masks. Carbon masks. I keep saying charcoal masks, but... Wow, I have 53 kids. Hmm. All right, how's everything else going? I have another recycler doing cloth, that's good. These farmers are doing okay. Doing quite well. Still gathering up our stuff, I guess. So I have two herbal huts right here? Oh, oh, one's a gather, okay. I see. One is a gatherer's cabin and the other one is a herbal thingy. Okay. How are my foresters lodges? One there, this one. Let's move it to be more like that. And then this one. Pretty good. Starting to get a little bit of wood. Um, still have some homeless people and protective clothing issues. Alright. Feel like speeding it up. Let's get through that drought. All right, go to the trading post to visit the barter trade deal. I mean, I guess it's done. Did I get cloth? No, I didn't. Huh. Oh yeah, I got cloth, okay. I guess the logis logisticians, the workers, have to uh, go get it and bring it to the warehouse. Makes sense. Ooh, I almost have enough activated carbon masks. Cool. My expedition is traveling. Where are they? Oh, they're down here. Right? Where's my Fellowship of the Ring? Oh, there they are. That's so cool. I love the explorer part of this. You have different areas of the, the buildings to explore. Um, you need different people with different skill sets to you know to go to the different area like if you have a medical facility you need a medical professional to know what to look for um, you know when scavenging the place very very cool I like it little concerned at the food situation still. Let's 
Let's put another um, pasture. Let's put another pasture in here. Right there. Yeah, that'd be a good place. Then that one can have deer or boars or whatever. Oh, you know what these floating lanterns are? Does that mean that people died? No, oh, I've only had seven people die. Or, I guess, there's only been seven people collected by the morticians. Oh, I need to move that. Okay, let's move this over... Um, let's clear out this area. Yes, it's a sure thing this new tailor shop will do a wonderful job. We've already started production and achieved the preliminary figures, Chief. So I get 30, 38 activated carbon masks. Awesome. That is definitely good news. Um, yeah, definitely good news. Okay. Cloth. Next scarf. No. Radiation suit. Yeah, that's good. All right, cool. Oh, man, look at my food. It's going, s oh, it's going up now. Okay, cool. What else can I build in the food department? Um, I should probably build another hunting lodge. Because they also help me capture animals for... Um, you know, for my little pasture land, whatever you call it. I just got an achievement, industrialist. I'll find out after I log off, I guess. Oh man, this is almost done. 1.4 seasons left to get about 30 more herbs. I think I can do it. Water situation is good. What haven't I built yet? I haven't built a food station, but that's just... I don't know. That's so they don't have to waste time going back and forth here. I want to upgrade that bus to a town center. Then we're going to get, you know, our own town government, get our own police department. Right? Is that next? Get our own, like, court system. Alright, speed things up. This place is growing like crazy. Yes, Chief, we actually found something, but the specimen is more of a small and weak one. We should handle it with the utmost care. Ooh. Oh, it's the plant. I'm like, wh what are we talking about? 
If we create an environment for the seedling where it can grow safely, maybe it might pull through. If we construct a module for our irrigation plant, and speci our specialists think it has good chances. How? Irrigation plant built. Okay, I need to build another one. Um, let's build the other one. So we have that one there. Let's do one. Uh, kind of bit myself in the butt right there. Let's do one right here. Uh, I don't know. I do want to keep this farmland up here. Let's do it over here. And I'll eventually clear that out. Um, water stored is going to be fine. Plastic stored. Oh, yeah, we're close on that, too. Okay. keep hearing my dog barking, and I have to keep seeing what he's barking at. He's just the wind. All right, still have 11 homeless. See, they were like making settlers, making people faster than we can house them. So let's do some more roads here. Just kind of randomly connect those. And then let's just fill this in with houses. We'll do something else right there. Oh. We're there. The message can't be seen at all from down here. Why would they have written it on the roof back then? Maybe they actually thought they'd be rescued. Whatever. We'll take a look around inside. Alright. Main entrance. Uh, I have metal tools. I have settlers badges. Okay, so I'm good on that. Let's try the main entrance. Ready to roll. We can give the front door or the back door a try. We've got tools with us. Up till now, we've gotten in everywhere with them. That is true. So that's what we're working on right now. Getting in that front door. Thanks to the crowbar, the door didn't hold up for long. We ought to be able to get into every floor from the stairwell. The dust is inch thick on the stairs here. No one else has been here for ages. So this is like an apartment complex. All the apartments on this floor... Wow, there's a lot of floor. Um, seem to have been cleared out. The inhabitants probably packed up their belongings and abandoned their apartments to find a place to survive. We'll take a look around. Maybe we'll still find something useful. We have a genuine Marco Polo with us. Hmm. Oh well, better than nothing. A few pieces of old clothing, an old cloth, empty cans of food, uh, some scrap. One second. There's still something left here. A box full of books. Oh, nice. Our experts discovered them under a pile of junk. Looks like teaching materials. Like the old out-of-print exercise books we had in the end zone. We can put this to good use for our school. So I get a, a knowledge point. Uh, all six of the explorers get the teacher badge. Uh, we got some metal, cloth, and scrap. Cool. Progress. 60%. Is there more? Where did he did that? Okay. Phew, that was no piece of cake. But, thanks to the right amount of force along with the hammer and chisel, we were able to chisel out the lock. Hey, wait a sec. 
The only thing here is a damn note. Listen to this, Chief. Public address, private key, and some sequences of numbers and letters. What the blazes is that supposed to be? Did we write it down? Looks like the inhabitants set up a little cachet of supplies up here to survive. There's canned food, mattresses, blankets, medicine. The food's probably not all edible anymore, but we'll give the supplies a once over. We were just in the process of compiling the last useful thing. Wait, something odd, Chief. One of the bedrooms is scribbled from top to bottom with phrases like there's no hope in the north or rescues on its way. There's an impression shaped like a human body on a mattress on the floor. Not a pretty sight. The remains have probably decayed into dust. But at least that explains what happened to one of the survivors. Did the others find a refuge up north? So it took down 50% of their confidence? That's crazy. Alright, so I'm 100% done with this. I can... Fill up my packs. Looks like I'll have no problem with that. Safe trip home. Cool. So they are done. They're way down there too. Um, yeah, get some cool stuff out of that. Drought is coming very soon. What else is going on? Uh, let's see what other missions I can do. Feast. Oh, I do need to build confidence. But I need to finish something else. Yeah. Are there any decrees I want to do? Let's see. Loitering ban. Oh, that's the one I researched. Um, prohibits from boosting their confidence by visiting their homes. I don't like that, really. Search for settlers. Water rationing. Food rationing. That lowers confidence. All that stuff. Banish elderly. Come on. <clears throat> that um, reduces the contentedness of the remaining settlers by three. Banish children? Birth control? I don't want to do any of these. Yeah, I don't... I mean, some of these other ones... Immunity might be cool. And diligence... They increase the durability of their tools and clothing, but move slower. And then same with this motivation. It increases their food and water consumption by 10%, but they're 25% faster. I mean, that's that seems worth it. So I'll open up those at some point. All right. Drought is coming. Way tons of people. All right, so now I have two knowledge points. Should I go straight to Sturdy House? What do I need to do that? Um, hemp weaving mill, which will produce cloth from hemp instead of scrap. But I don't, I can't grow hemp right now, so I don't know. Uh, warehouse. Electricity. I think I talked about this uh, advanced school last time. Let's do that. Because, uh, you know... I have so many, 60 kids and only three schools. I, I'd like to get them through there more quickly.
All right, let's speed it up. Uh oh. Having that product uh, protective clothing problem again. Need coal. How many coal plants do I have? I thought I had two. Yeah, I do have two. One there, one there. Wow, I have 23 settlers who are not assigned to anything. Irrigator. More farmers. More herders. More hunters. Herbalist. Tailors? Why do I... I don't have enough tailors. Um, teacher. Medic. Oh, I just spent a lot of them. I only have five left, but that's fine. Another trader has arrived. Awesome. Let's see. Hey, I hope the sleazy settlement has stuff I can do something with. At any rate, it's your lucky day because Lizzie Rasmus, that's precisely what you pitiful little ones are looking for. She's nice. Seems like a nice young lady. All right, well, she, she has. Okay. Oh, coal. Sulfur wood. <clears throat> well, I have tons of food. I can give her food for a couple of those. Sulfur iodine. Coal. <clears throat> That looks good. Don't want to give away too much food because we're actually <laughs> having a problem where it's going down. You're not exactly making the best impression. Oh. With those long faces, it's already about <clears throat> as low as it gets. Come on. Shove that stuff over here before I get second thoughts. All right. Cool. So that is going to happen. Very cool. Oh, which I need all that stuff. Huh? Let's finish out this uh, orchard here. It kind of drives me crazy that it's not all the way to the road, you know? Can I do that? Oh, I can't do that. Oh, well. What else? I can make another fishing hut. Once I unlock this kitchen, I'll be able to make better food, uh, which will be more efficient, which will be cool. Just not there yet. Researching, researching advanced school right now.
Let's see. Every once in a while, you just have to check up on your gatherers. Make sure they're doing what they're supposed to do. Um, they've almost cleared that out. That'll be next right there, so I can expand my little re residential area. Okay, let's see. Oh, I didn't want to do that. I wanted to be like that. Another little block. Oh yeah, drought. Everything's dried up. Still, man. That is a, an endless chase to try to house enough settlers, that is for sure. Here, I'm going to make another... I guess I'll make another shelter for the ones that aren't housed yet. I'll make it back here. Right about there. I can't believe I have so many people. Oh, little expeditions coming back home. Look at them. They have a lot of stuff with them, which should help us, hopefully. It'd be cool if when the explorers are coming back, there was like a ticker tape parade and people were all excited to see him and all that. Giant deer walking down the street. No big deal. Is this upgraded yet? No. Oh, it's on its way. It's being upgraded. 46%. Cool. That'll be a town center. Um, campfire. Change field of work. Does that mean who gets the water or where they where they get the water? The water source. Well, I guess we have pumps and cisterns and all that, so. 
try it like that. How'd you like to go to school like that? I actually love that design. It's really cool. Oh, it's weird. What is everybody's problem? Cloth and coal. Cloth and coal. Cloth and coal. Cloth. Still gathering wood. Oh, there goes the... The expedi expedition returned home. Potential loot is stored in the expedition station. Awesome. Awesome. Cool. All right, this is waiting for me to choose an animal. I'm gonna go with deer on this one. Okay, so we'll be housing some deer here and hopefully help with the food problem that we're having. I wanna get another expedition going too. Let's see, where can we go next? Uh, gas station ruin, is that the one right there? Factory. Wow, look at all those, there are a ton of them. All right, let's go to this one, it's super close. Mark for salvaging, I think we already did that one. Um, that's so far away, let's do this one. Send scout. Oh good, they're finally building those houses, man. Oh, my water situation. Oh, we're in a drought. That's right. Yeah. Hopefully we'll recover after that drought. Hey, Chief, Scott One on the line. I found a site here that could be interesting for our folks. Lots of steel, containers, and a big plot of land. But I'd recommend bringing along tools and being careful. Although it's been standing for a while, it could still collapse. All right, let's set up an expedition. So we're looking for a refiner badge, who these three right here have it. And everyone needs metal tools, so no problem. Uh, Florentine will go. Let's see, who's not important? Patrick is not important. Um, charcoal burner. I need every charcoal burner. Let's send Johnny. Send Lisa. Eugene. And one more. Let's send Kevin. Kevin. Let's do 10, wait. Is it saying I need 60 or, 
Oh, that's how many are there. Okay. Metal tools. There we go. Uh, and protective clothing. I don't... Uh, they don't really need it. So I'm just going to go back to... No protective clothing. If it said up here you need a certain kind of clothing, of course, then I would do it. But I don't want to wait, so. There we go. Expedition is heading out. Well, soon. They have to make rations first. Right. <clears throat> Let's build some more cabins. I think I'll fit one right in here. Might as well. It's, it's a rural property. It's off the road, you know, goes for a little bit more. It has some, some waterfront area right there, so. Oh, I should build them over here, too. There we go. Let's do a couple right here, too. Uh, just one. Hopefully, this will take care of our homeless problem. I need to pay attention to all these little floating question marks and stuff because it usually means that there's something going on. Like this right here. I just upped the production limit. Right? Problem solved. Um, who else is having a problem? Oh, are they out of resources? No. But they took care of all that scrap over there. I can start building out some roads. Which, as you know, is one of my favorite things to do. Hope something f fits in there. Go ahead and build a food station. Since we are getting food from right there, let's make one. Let's make one up here. Just for the heck of it. That'll be for the workers up here. What's their deal? Need herbs. Oh, we had a drought. They need a new spot for getting wood. Right there. Uh, what else? They're still good. Food is getting a little low. Wow, 80 kids. 
This is not going to cut it for a farmland, that is for sure. But we're going to try it. We're just going to make, oh, can I not do that big? Hmm, I don't want to do that either. Let's do one right here. I guess they have to be like a certain size. do that and we'll grow I guess beans we need to find more stuff to grow now I can hire more farmers This one's almost done. Man, the, it's a never ending battle to try to house these settlers. It's crazy. But I'm gonna. Oh, there's scrap right there. Let's get these guys to clear this out. Very serious business here. <laughs> Building houses. I'm just imagining the look on my face. I'm like, Building houses. Alright, that's a ton of houses, people. not done yet either. Oh, it's getting there. Hmm. New trader. Oh, it's that person again. I, a familiar face. I like that. Did you miss old t -Barra? I certainly hope so. <laughs> Hurry up. Take a look around. So they have like a return. She's got extraordinary stuff with her again. Return dialogue. I could get some hemp. Um and then I could make the hemp factory thing. Wood and medicine. Well, I have a lot of medicine. Although, let's trade medicine for joints. That's what they call it. And hemp. Maybe some cloth, too. Oh. Yeah, let's try that. Bunch of medicine for a bunch of medicine. 
Oh, my. What a delightful offer. Old T-Barter is more than happy. How good you are to an old lady. It's true, believe me. <laughs> One genuine heck of a customer. Thanks. Come on, people. Let's build these houses down here. Do away with our homeless problem. Um, yeah, we hustled really hard to provide them with the best possible welcome to our new settlement. We'll take care of them. Chief? Oh, they said they had some medicine with them that they wanted to share with us. Awesome, because I just got rid of a bunch of medicine. <laughs> Whoo, 188 people. All right, so the only thing I have going now is store more water. Yikes, it's actually going down. And more plastic. All right, let's work on this water situation because it is getting pretty low. Uh, let's see. Rainwater collector. Well. Produces water slowly, but uncontaminated by radiation, regardless of droughts. Short distances between wells reduce their efficiency. Oh, okay. Oh, and it can be upgraded, too. Which is cool. Let's do another well. So we have a well... Right, uh, right there? Oh, right there. All right, let's do one over yonder. Well, let's do one right there because we need more water. We're starting to have a water problem. Should I build another jetty? I feel like I should. Yeah. We've made it, Chief. I think this here was supposed to become a building at some point, but it was never completed. Man, this is really incredible. There's still equipment standing around that was used for construction. Apparently building materials and containers, too. The things in the back, I think they're old toilets from way back when. But we'd be better off not using them. Probably not. The whole world is your toilet. <laughs> Alright, is there anything useful there? We'll see, Chief. We can take a closer look at the containers and the building itself. Besides that, there might be something to find at the toilets. They keep talking about the toilets. The remnants... Okay, let's continue... Damn it, one of us fell off the ladder. 25%. Uh, the rung broke. That didn't have to happen. All that action didn't really get us anywhere either. The room was empty. Except for a little metal. Do I make like a metal joke? Like, you know. You can always use more metal or... Alright, that one is done. That's the shipping container. Uh, or no, that was the... I don't Chief, I think these things here are old construction containers. If memory serves me, building debris was collected in them to have it transported from the construction site later on. So, it's a definite possibility that we won't find much useful stuff here. Luckily, we have someone along who knows more about what we can recycle and what we can't make any use of. And that is the refiner. Ha, I got it open. We had to do a round we had to do a roundabout job of prying the cover open, but it was worth it. Thanks to our experienced people, we were able to do a good job of assessing what's usable and what's not. Cool. Old containers are used on ships. Uh it's no problem getting in with the tools, okay. Got the containers open, got some metal. 
Damn, t damn tough piece of work. The locking mechanism was completely rusted, so the only way we could move the door was with a lot of muscle. If we hadn't had the tools, I know for a fact that we wouldn't have gotten in. Alright, here's the toilets right here. This is our favorite. Blue containers that are used to be used as toilets. The elderly say that sometimes things are found in them. At least that's apparently the way it was in some old video games. Nice. Let's see what we find. <laughs> no, no, and no way. That was one big zero. We went in, saw disgusting stuff, and headed right back out again. Really nasty stuff. Let's change the subject. All right, 100% done. Loot and return. Grab all our stuff. Cool. Loot and return. Safe trip home. That'll be a helpful thing. And it was just right here, too. Where's it at? Um, oh, it was the one that was right here. So that's cool. Gotta check out this construction site. Oh, this one's already been scouted. Okay. We'll wait till the people come home. Alright, I need... More water. I was going to build another jetty, wasn't I? We have one here. Let's build one over here. Um... Right there. So once that's built, we'll be able to collect more water. Oh, it's right by the well, too. Oh, no, it's a food station. Okay. Fields are doing well. I did upgrade my little bus to its town center. That's cool. Hmm. My turnover rates are pretty bad. Limitation on protective clothing. I don't want to do that. I don't really see what the town center does for me. But. Need coal. Need coal. Need coal. Come on, coal people. Alright, now I think I've just built some stuff, so let's allocate some new workers I guess I didn't I get, get another well keeper huh okay one thing I do want to do is send out another scout while this expedition is returning um what else can we check out a lot of stuff. Let's scout this one. Interesting location. So I have two scouts. I might as well send another one, right? Yeah, we'll send the scouts out. All right, but it looks like it's about time for me to go. Once again, I've played over my time that I told myself I would stop because I love this game so much. Um, I did pick up, so Steam is having a sale right now, a Survivor Fest or something like that, Survival Fest. And I just wrote an article about it today about some really great uh, things to check out over at postapocalyptic.com. 
Um, great games. I'm you know we're not affiliated with Steam or anything like that. I just love Steam games, and um, so I picked up Frostpunk. It looks like a really great game. I'll probably maybe I'll stream that tomorrow, or at least sometime this week or something. So yeah, you have that to look forward to. It looks like a really cool game. It was like seventy five percent off or something crazy. So had to pick it up. Uh, but thanks everyone for watching. I really enjoy this and um, yeah, it's a lot of fun. So thanks a lot and take care.